and welcome to Nishcraft. My name is Cassie and I'm your host and today is Mystery Bag Monday and I am so excited because look at what I have. This is kind of heavy too. I've got some hobby yards and I've got two bags so I'm really excited to look in these. I, I remember some of the stuff that I ordered. I ordered something for myself and I ordered another kind of mystery bag. So we're going to open this right here on the channel, and we get to watch! <laughs> Alright, so Hobie is a yarn company, bag in a bag, huh? Look at this. Hobie is a yarn company from Denmark, okay? And they have really good deals on yarn if you shop right, okay? And... I'm looking for a receipt here, so I can tell you how to shop with this. Oh, how funny, it says make an unboxing video and win. Oh look, they've got a candy in here, holy candy. Okay, so here's... Okay, so I'm pretty certain that these are my mystery bags of the kind that is... Acrylic, yeah. So these are my two acrylic mystery bags. And it doesn't say what the amount was that I spent on these, but it was reasonable. <laughs> okay. And then here is my mystery cake bag. And then I ordered something for myself, and I don't want to bore you guys with what I ordered for myself. So I will show that at the end. And they always have something a little free that they that they send to you and so what they sent were these oh how nice they're wool needles these are actually really really nice in fact I don't even think that I have wool needles that are this nice <laughs> so I got some wool needles so I'm sorry guys I'm gonna have to keep this one for myself but next time I order I'll get some for you guys too or I'll find some for you guys in a giveaway later on okay so apparently it always comes with some candy in the bag um, this is my first time ordering from Hobie too, so <laughs> if I'm a little excited, like more than usual about mystery bags, it's because this, it's, it's my first time. So yeah, they always come with these little candies. I hear they're really, really good. I'm on a diet right now, but I think I'm going to try it eventually. <laughs> and I'll just leave a comment below telling you how, how it went, <laughs> or maybe I'll just leave it in the description or something. Um, but yeah, these are my cakes and these are my acrylics. I'm going to start with the acrylics, okay guys? Now, I have seen a lot of unboxing of Hobie yarn. Oh, these are not the acrylics, these are cakes. I have to save those for the end. Oh wait, did I order two? I did! I ordered two cake bags. <laughs> okay, well we're going to save the cake bags till the end. And we will order, we will open the two acrylic bags at the beginning. See, I don't have a receipt that tells me what I ordered, so I didn't know. <laughs> so I forgot that I had ordered two of them. So yeah, the cake ones were $40 when I ordered them. We'll see if we get $40 worth. And the acrylics, I can't remember how much they were when I ordered them. Maybe there's another receipt inside these? I don't know. So we'll start with this. Wow, I'm already seeing some things that are really nice. Now, before I before I get it out, I want to say I have watched Hobie um, mystery bag unboxings before, and I know that they tend to send a lot of this one brand of yarn that are kind of like I call them Easter egg yarns, um, even when it's not like April. <laughs> and and um, so they're like these little kind of smaller balls, but they send you in all sorts of colors and you can mix and match them. Really good for hats and that kind of stuff. So I'm expecting to get some of those, okay? Just basically acrylic um, kind of small balls. I'm actually hoping that I get them because I, I think they're pretty and I want to know what it feels like to work with them. But um, I'm already super surprised and happy because it looks like they included some different things for me. Now this is called Go Handmade Coacher, a sophisticated, elegant yarn, super soft it is, with a scrumptious wool feel, perfect for a touch of glamour in your knitting projects. Oh wow, this is really pretty. Um, 
So, it doesn't say what the weight is, but this 50 grams is 50 meters, all right? So that would be like, what, 55 yards, something like that. Um, and this is in the colorway, doesn't say. <laughs> okay, so, so the color is a number, I think, 17403. This is beautiful. This is really, really beautiful. I would say it's like a top color. Yeah, it's like a grayish, like beige and gray combined. <laughs> I love that word. <laughs> All right. So here, see, it's really interesting because one of these has like a, a Santa Claus on it. So I think this is supposed to be used for Christmas. Yeah, let's do the, let's do the ones with the Santa Claus on it. Cause this one does not have a Santa Claus on it, but I, it looks kind of similar. Anyway, so I think this is supposed to be used for Christmas. Yeah, Christmas Universe. It's 98% acrylic, 2% polyester. That is probably those gorgeous little flakes right in there. And it's a, a 3.5 ounce or 100 gram ball and it's 462 meters or 505 yards. Wow, I wonder what weight that is. Ah, oh, it's a super fine weight. This is really pretty. I mean, that looks to me like a flower garden. <laughs> so if, even if Santa wasn't on there, I would still, I would still want to work with it, even if it's not Christmas. So I really think that's pretty. So I have one of those. I think all of these are in the same colorway. Not certain. Christmas universe. Let's see, color 23. Which color is this one? Color 23. Okay, so this is the same. So I've got one, two, all right, and this one is not the same. Okay, so I'll, I'll keep this down. So look at that. Oh, wow. It's got a little piece of fuzz on, on it there. Those are really, really pretty. That looks like flower garden, doesn't it? I bet I could make a shawl out of that or something like that. It's so pretty. This is really, really beautiful. Wow. It's not just for Christmas. It really isn't. Although it would be pretty colors for Christmas too. <laughs> so I got two of those. Oh, look at this. Colorina. 80% acrylic, 20% wool. This is so, so soft. And this is also in those like, those beautiful colors. I see some blue in there. Okay. Yeah. See, so it's got some blues. Let's see if I can find anything else. I always think it looks gross when people like open up their yarn to show you the different colors, even though I don't know why it looks gross. It just does to me. <laughs> I think that this shows all the colors and I kind of messed up that thing a little bit, but it's okay. <laughs> so yeah, this is called Colorina. It's 80% acrylic, 20% wool. Um, color nine. Let me see if I can get the yardage here. Okay, so this is a three weight yarn and we have 200 meters or 218 yards, yards. <laughs> All right, that's really pretty. Let's see what this is. Is this the same thing, I wonder? No, this is, this is an acrylic. So 98% acrylic, 2% polyester. This is called Universe. Okay, so this is Christmas Universe, and this is called Universe. They look pretty similar, but one of them has, like, obviously green in it, and the, and the green is, like, the it, the sparkly flecks are in green. And this one um, looks like it has a more pale green or even almost a yellow color there, and this, the flecks are in um, pink, right? So I got one ball of that. Oh, look at this, it's another colorina. And this is in a monochrome color of, of um, white, gray, and black. That's so pretty. And with my neck lamp, <laughs> I've got an unboxing and review for that on this site, on this channel, I can work with this dark color. So again, this is 80% acrylic, 20% wool. Um, 50 grams, 200 meters or 218 yards, 
And again, this is a three weight, so this is what I have so far. That's really pretty. Both of these. I wouldn't want to mix them. <laughs> I don't think they go together very well, but they're very pretty. So let's see what's in this one. Oh! Oh, I got some of the little, the little small ones, the little amigos, the little Easter eggs. So I'm glad. I'm so happy that I got them. So these are just 100% acrylic yarns. They're 50 gra grams, um, 175 meters or 191 yards each. Um, this is a weight three. Um, and it's in this amigo, which is some kind of hobby, hobby brand. And I was really hoping that I could make something with this. I got two in this light color pink, which is color 47. One in this white. Okay. And one in this darker color pink. So that looks really pretty. I could make something with all four. With these four, I could probably make some kind of like baby item. I could make like a, maybe a hat and a scarf or maybe like a little a little sweater, something like that. Really, really pretty. I'm so happy I got those little Easter eggs. Not that I'm not happy with this. So we have another universe here. And this one is called... Hmm. Oh, this one's also called Universe. <laughs> so I think these either are mislabeled or... Yeah, I think that they're mislabeled. Um, so I don't know if this really is... Um, universe <laughs> okay no no okay i've got it i got it now this is universe this is also universe the color in this one is color number 32 the color in this one is color number five all right and they're gorgeous this one has blue flex this one has um the pink flex that i told you about and then this christmas color which is called christmas universe this is in color 23 all right so this and this, they're probably both called Universe, but this one's Christmas Universe. Hopefully I made sense. So I've got these, and I've got two more of those Christmas colors. Color 23, color 23, as long as that label is correct. Look at that. And I don't even really think that looks so Christmassy. I mean, yeah, it is. I mean, it definitely is red and green. You can definitely see it really well right here, right? But it also looks like a flower garden, like I said. I think it looks like a flower garden. If I say it's a flower garden, then maybe it'll be true. <laughs> so I'm really, really excited. So I got, I ended up getting one, two, three, four. I ended up getting five of these. Okay? That's really, really great. It's funny because Greg's in here and he's not even looking. Look what I found. I got another one of that grage. One of those grage. I think if Greg saw this, he would be like, oh my gosh, those are so pretty. So I got four of this Christmas universe with the green flecks and all of that. Two of these grage ones. Four of the little Easter eggs that I was hoping to get. <laughs> and two of these, um, 80% acrylic, 20% wool. So re so that's good to know. The acrylic bags can have wool in it too, okay? Um, so it's probably just acrylic wool blends though. It's probably not just wool. So keep that in mind when you're ordering from them. And then I got one of these in color number 32 and one of these in color number Five. And I think that my favorite one is turning into this color number five. That is so pretty. Isn't that beautiful? Gosh, those are so pretty. So I am very happy with my acrylic bags. Let me make sure that there's not anything else in here. Okay, I'm putting that to the side here. Here's my wool needles. And next. We're going to open the cake bag, and I do remember the price on these was $40 for each one, and so I'm really looking forward to this. These are not craft scissors. These are regular scissors. I do not cut plastic or paper or anything like that with my craft scissors, just so you know. I'm very particular about that. We keep them sharp. Oh my goodness. Oh, these are beautiful. They're not banded, though, so I don't know what they are. Look at that. 
Oh, it's got a little pull thing on it. Cotton Kings. It's a Cotton King. And it's got this dark purple out here. And it gradually goes into this um, darker pink, lighter pink, all the way to white at the very, at the very center. That makes such a beautiful shawl. Oh my god, it's so pretty. And this is just one of them. I got four in here. Okay? Yeah, I got four. Oh my gosh, that is so beautiful. Wow. Look at this one. I am like really seriously stunned. I am really stunned by these. This is so beautiful. It's another Cotton Kings one. Very good for a shawl. Um, I'm trying to think of somebody who's made a shawl out of them. Um, Crystal at Bago Day, she made a shawl and it's called Killer Queen. She's got a pattern up for it. She made it with one of these, okay, with a Cotton King ball of yarn, okay, or cake, obviously. It's a big cake. I don't even know how many yards are in this. I should have brought my um, computer with me, but I'll go ahead and leave that in the description below so you guys can know that because, wow. I cannot believe how beautiful and vivid these colors are. I know you probably want me to just take out the next one, but these are so stunning. Like, just these two would be totally worth it. But I have two more in this bag, and I've got another bag. Oh my gosh! Look at this one! Oh wow, look at that! That is so pretty! It, it has another easy start tag right here, okay? It's obviously also a Cotton King, but it starts with this beautiful orange. It goes out to yellow and green, light blue and dark blue. It's like a rainbow. It's just missing the red. That's it. Oh, isn't that pretty? This is so pretty. Oh my goodness. So happy, and look at this one. I'm trying to see if I have it. No, I don't have one with the white outside, but this is so beautiful. Look at this blue. Oh my gosh, this is gorgeous. Oh my goodness, and I got all four of these in just one of those cake mystery bags. I would totally, totally recommend this. These are gorgeous. Every single one of these is gorgeous. And it's, I know this is enough yards to make a really big shawl. So I am just really stunned. This is, and I think these are at least 20, if not $30 each. If you buy, if you don't buy them on sale. Now I really wish that I had my computer with me. <laughs> I will leave all of that information in the description for the cakes. Okay, I'm not going to look up all of the different stuff. For the acrylics, though, I'm so excited about this. Oh, I think that I got the same cakes, which is really awesome. Look at this! Oh, another blue one. Look at this! Isn't that beautiful? Got another one. <laughs> I'm so excited. And I got another gray one. I know somebody whose gray is their favorite color, and it's not um, Adam. Adam Dirtz, the guy from Counting Crows, like, he says that gray is his favorite color, Mr. Jones, but I know another person who gray is their favorite color. I think gray is really pretty. It's, it goes really well with purple, doesn't it? Yeah. <laughs> I'm so excited. I'm so happy. Another rainbow! Isn't that beautiful? Oh, this is the easy start. So this is you work from. Oh my gosh. You guys. And another purple to pink to white gradient. Oh, that is so pretty. So, that's the end of my grab bags, okay? I got candy, I got a bunch of acrylic, I even got some acrylic wool blends, I got my cotton cakes, but I have one more thing that I got for myself because when I heard about the sales going on on Hobie, um, and that is H-O-B-B-I. I'll have a link in the description, okay? Um, I saw these, and I was like, I have to have these. <laughs> so I got four of these, all right? So I don't know if you remember, but 
I showed the Red Heart. It's a wrap. No, I got three of them. <laughs> There's another piece of candy, too. So, I got, um, I showed you guys the Red Heart. It's a wrap in one of my giveaways, okay? And this is basically the same thing in that it's, it's, um, really fine. It's got, it's got those nice pull tabs here, okay? I love that. But this is called, I, I mean, it, the, the name is, is also beautiful. Okay, it doesn't say on here, but I remember it was called Chocolate Rose. And look at that beautiful, like, really, really light rose pink. It's like this kind of muted pink, you know? It's not like the bright, it's not the, the very, very bright, like, hot pink like this. It's kind of muted. And it goes from this lighter pink out um, into this kind of like brown color and then you've got this beautiful like dark rose color and then you've got this dark brown at the very end and it is so beautiful and I had to get three of them because I was afraid that if I didn't get three of them I was gonna regret it <laughs> I was thinking it would have my original thought was okay I've got to get at least two and then I was like no I gotta get three I want to make sure that I have something that I can make with this so yeah and um I just want to make sure you guys know that this this little pull tab, you know, this, there's actually multiple strings here. There's four strings, just like in the It's a Wrap. So anyway, I was interrupted. Like I had a delivery and my dog is barking and I don't remember what I was talking about. But the bottom line is that I got three of these. I'm going to make something beautiful with it. And I will definitely share it with the channel, okay? And my works in progress and my finished objects. You will see whatever I make with this. And I'm probably going to keep at least one of these for myself to make a shawl or something like that. Um, for Well, for a friend, you know, <laughs> or for somebody in this family or something. Like, I think my daughter would really like this particular color, for example. Um, and I actually really like this gray. That might make something pretty. But, um, definitely happy with my purges. I think it's great. I will for sure order from them again. There's no way that I wouldn't. The only thing is that when I, um, when I ordered them, I think that I ended up qualifying for free shipping because of how, the amount of, the total amount of my order, and so I didn't pay for, like, super fast shipping, so it was a kind of a long wait for me because I did not pay that super fast shipping. Like I said again, it came from Denmark, though, and given that I mean, I could have paid it, but it would have been a lot, you know, comparably. Um, and I'd actually recommend if you if you want to save on on Hobie, go ahead and I would definitely recommend ordering their mystery box with the cakes. This is just beautiful and it is such a good deal. I know that I know that all four of these together, like four of these together, would cost way more than that um, mystery box did and you can also catch some sales and get things that you know maybe you don't like this but I love it um, get something for yourself too you know they have a lot of sales going on at all times um, I don't have my community tab open yet but when I do I'll post about sales okay so just so you guys know um, actually since I'm pre-recording this I actually might have my community tab open if I do, <laughs> then I will definitely post whenever there's a sale at Hobie Yarn so you can take advantage of the sale. Um, and I'm like, I'm like ready to go right back on their site in order again. I'm not going to, but I'm, I'm ready to do it. <laughs> so um, you can look for some of the things that I got in my um, mystery bags on my mystery boxes on Etsy. And they might show up in some giveaways, so do keep that in mind, I have a lot of giveaways, so you might be the next winner. You might win one of these. It would be cool. Alrighty, guys. Thank you guys so much for watching to the end. As always, make sure to comment, like, subscribe, share this with somebody if you think that they would enjoy it. Um, share it with your friends. <laughs> you know, share it with um, somebody who you live with or, any, you know, just anybody if you want. You know, you don't have to. It's not going to upset me if you don't. Um, but I always appreciate the support. I read every comment. Thank you guys so much for your wonderful, supportive, beautiful comments. And I'm just so happy right now because I just got a whole bunch of yarn. 
<laughs> and I cannot wait to just give it away <laughs> so that other people can enjoy this as much as I do. Thank you again. Bye.